What's up again, YouTubers? It's Francis UD again. So, uh, just like to do a quick video, um, you know, for reading the Bible. And uh, in case you happen to, to you know, to feel the passion for reading the Bible, to immerse yourself in God's words, then let us proceed and read the Bible with me. Um, for this filming session, I just like to read, um, you know, by I just like to get myself more familiarized with the Gospel of Luke, and uh, you know, starting by chapter one, and it can take a while. So, yes, the Gospel of Luke, the Gospel according to Luke, KJV version, um, chapter one. For as much as many have taken in the hand to get forth in order a declaration of those with things which are most surely believed among us, even as they deliver them unto us, which from the beginning were eyewitnesses and ministers of the word. It seemed good to me also, having had perfect understanding of all things from the very first, to write unto thee in order, most excellent, the Olif um, the Ophilus, Ophilius, <laughs> sorry, I pronounced it wrongly, maybe, that thou mightest know the certainty of those things wherein thou hasn't been instructed. There was in the day of Herod, the, um, Herod, the king of Judea, a certain priest named Zacharias, of course, of Abiah, and his wife was the daughter of Aaron, and her name was Elizabeth. And there were both righteous before God, walking in all the commandments and ordinances of the Lord blameless. And they had no child, because that Eli um, El Elizabeth was barren, and they were they both know they bo both were now well stricken in years and it came to pass that while he executed the priest's office before god in order of his course according to the custom of the priest's office his lot was to burn in was to burn incense when he went into the temple of the lord and the whole multitude of the people were praying without at the time of incense and there appeared unto him an angel of the lord standing on the right side of the altar of incense and when zacharias saw him he was troubled and fear tell upon and fear fell upon him <coughs> excuse me but the angel said un unto him fear not zacharias for thy pri thy prayer is heard and thy wife Elizabeth shall bear thee a son, and thou shalt call his name John, and thou shalt have joy and gladness, and many shall rejoice at his birth. For he shall be great in the sight of the Lord, and shall drink neither, neither wine nor strong drink, and he shall be filled with the Holy Ghost, even from his mother's womb. And many of the children of Israel shall he turn to the Lord their God, and he shall go before him in the spirit and power of um, Elias to turn the hearts of, of, of the fathers to the children and the disobedient to the wisdom of the just, to make ready a people prepared for the Lord. And Zechariah said unto the angel, Whereby shall I know this? For I am an old man, and my wife well stricken in years. And the angel answered and said unto him, I am Gabriel, that stand in the presence of God, and I am sent to speak unto thee, and to show thee these glad tidings. And behold, thou shalt be dumb, and not be able to speak, unto the day that these things shall be performed, because thou believest not my words, which shall be fulfilled in their season. <laughs> and the people waited for Zacharias, 
and marveled that he tarried so long in the temple, and when he came out, he could not speak unto them, and they perceived that he had been the vision in the temple. Then they perceived that that he had had seen a vision in the temple, for he um, be, um, beckoned unto them and remained speechless. And it came to pass that as soon as the days of his ministration were accomplished, he departed to his own house. And after those days, his wife Elizabeth conceived and hid herself five months, saying, Thus hath the Lord dealt with me in the days wherein he looked on me to take away my reproach among men. And in the sixth, in the sixth, in the sixth month, the angel Gabriel was sent from God. <coughs> Excuse me unto a city of Galilee named Nazareth to a virgin imposed, um, espoused to a man whose name was Joseph of, of the house of David and the virgin's name was Mary and the angel came into came in unto her and said hail though that art highly favored the Lord is is with thee Blessed art thou among women. And when she saw him, she was troubled at his saying, and cast in her mind what manner of salution, um, salutation this should be. And the angel said unto her, Fear not, Mary, for thou hast found favor with God. And behold, thou shalt conceive in thy womb, and bring forth a son, and shalt call his name Jesus. He shall be great, and shall be called the Son of the Highest, and the Lord God shall give unto him the throne of his father David, and he shall reign over the house of Jacob forever, and of his kingdom there shall be no end. And then said Mary unto the angel, How shall this be, seeing I know not a man? And the angel answered and said unto him, the Holy Ghost shall come, shall come upon thee, and the power of the highest shall overshadow thee. Therefore also that holy thing which shall be born of thee shall be called the Son of God. And behold, thy cousin Elias, um, Elizabeth, he, um, she hath also conceived a son in her old age, and this is the sixth, the sixth month with her. Who was, who was called barren, for with God nothing shall be impossible. And Mary said, Behold, the, man, the handmaid of the Lord, be it unto me according to thy word. And the angel departed from her. And Mary arose in those days, and went into the hill country with haste, into a city of Judah, and entered into the house of Zacharias, and saluted El Elizabeth, and it came to pass when the when Elizabeth heard the salutation of Mary, the babe lived in her womb, and Elizabeth was was filled with the Holy Ghost, and she spake out with a loud voice and said, Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, and whence is this to me? that the mother of my Lord should come to me. For, lo, as soon as the voice of thy salutation sounded in my ears, the babe lived in my womb for joy, and blessed is she that believed. For there shall be a performance of those things which were told her from the Lord. And Mary said, My soul do, um, doth magnify the Lord, and my spirit hath rejoiced in God my Savior, for he hath regarded the low um, estate of his hand, handmaiden. For behold, for, for from henceforth all generations shall, be, shall call me blessed. For he that is mighty hath done to me great things, and holy is his name. For, and his mercy is on them that fear him from generation to generation. And he, um, he hath showed strength with his arm. He hath scattered the proud 
in the imagination of their hearts, he hath pulled down the mighty from their seats, and exalted <clears throat> them of low degree. He hath filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he hath sent empty away. He hath helpen, <clears throat> help, helpen his servant Israel in remembrance of his mercy, and he spake to our fathers, to Abraham, and to his seed forever. And Mary abode with her about three months, and <clears throat> returned to her own house. Now Elizabeth full time came that she should be delivered, and she brought forth a son. And her neighbors and her cousins heard how the Lord hath showed great mercy upon her, and they rejoiced with her. And it came to pass, and on the eighth day they came to circumcise the child, and they called him Zacharias, after the name of his father. And his mother answered and said, Not so, but she, he shall be called John. And they said unto her, There is none of my of thy kind, of thy kindred that is called by this name. And they made signs to his father how he would have him called. And he asked for a written table and wrote, saying, His name is John. And they marveled all. And his mouth was opened immediately, and his tongue loosed, and he spake, and praised God. And fear came on all that dwelt around about them. And all these sayings were noised aboard throughout all the hill country of Judea. And all they had heard them laid them up in their hearts, saying, What manner of child shall this be? And the hand of the Lord was with him. And his father Zacharias was filled with the Holy Ghost and prophesied, saying, Blessed be the Lord God of Israel, for he hath visited and redeemed his people, and hath raised up an horn of salvation for us in the house of his servant David. And he spake by the mouth of his holy priest, priest, prophets, which have been um, since the world began, that we should be saved from our enemies and from the hand of of all that hate us, to perform the mercy promised to our fathers, and to remember his holy covenant, the oath which he sware to our father Abraham, that he would grant unto us, that we, being delivered out of the hand of our enemies, might serve him without fear, in holiness and righteousness, before him all the days of our life. And thou, child, shalt be called the prophet of the highest, for thou shalt, shalt go before the face of the Lord to prepare his ways, to give knowledge of salvation unto his people by the remission of their sins, through the tender mercy of our God, whereby the dayspring from on high hath visited us, to give light to them that sit in darkness and in the shadow of death to guide our feet into the way of peace. And the child grew and waxed strong in spirit and was in the deserts to the day of his showing unto Israel. <sighs> this is so hard. I don't know. Um, how long it should take for a um, for a um, natively English speaking dude to finish up reading, you know, just you know, just um, the chapter, you know, chapter one of the Gospel of Luke. Um, perhaps King James version still poses a bit of a too much challenge. To me, so far, I just need more time to dip myself in the woods of God, you know. And you know, by by oh, Jesus, by worry, by worrying less and fapping less and less. Um, and uh, tomorrow, yes, um, I may 
I may lay myself to rest, you know, rather than making, um, ra rather than kind of, um, you know, compelling my, myself to, 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 to stay um, primed and frosty to make vids like this fashion. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed uh, my 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 uh, my my reading. Um, if you happen to spot any um, errors or mistakes in my pronunciation, please feel free to point them out by uh, by writing down your comments below this video. I will try my best to reply to each and every one of them. And uh, yeah, that's it for tonight. And uh, thank you very much for watching and listening. And uh, hope to see you guys next time on YouTube. Um, though I have scheduled another um, another another visitation, um, you know, to the to the doctor, to the psychiatrist, you know, who will, you know, who will um, continue to uh, observe my symptoms, you know, while I see him face to face. Yeah. Maybe yeah. I let's hope not, but um, you know, let's hope hope for the best. But still, you know, as the old pro proverb says, let's hope for the best, but prepare for the worst. In in case I do get my sorry ass hospitalized again in China, uh, and uh, there might be there might be a slim chance where I can't, you know, um, um, you know, sh show up on YouTube for at least um, maybe 7 or 14 consecutive days in total so just um, for your information um, in case that occurs to me so yeah thanks again and bye for now cheers